another cocktail kitchen. I hope you're all having a lovely week and leading into an even better weekend. It's the middle of October. We have the rest of autumn to get through and then winter. So we are going to be doing sort of a cocktails that have more brown liquors in them, more complex profiles, perhaps uh, deeper, richer tones within them. We're gonna use one of my favorite ingredients this week, which is Laird's Applejack. It's an apple brandy. So if you don't have a bottle of this in your house yet, I recommend getting it. Now in America, it retails for fairly cheap. I think it's like you can get it for anywhere between like, I think 20 and 30 bucks a bottle. Over here, because of import taxes and everything, it is gonna be a little more expensive. It might be about 30 pounds a bottle or so. So uh, I always bring back extra when I go back to the States. That's my little boop legging secret. You want to tell um, this is Right, so we're going to use the Laird's Applejack today. This is actually a cocktail called the Applejack Rabbit. And it's from about 1927, I think was the right date. So it is an older cocktail. Uh, Laird's Applejack itself is similar to a Calvados, which is basically what an apple brandy is. Calvados uh, uses different apples, and so this Laird's apple brandy uh, has a slightly different taste than Calvados, and it's why we don't call it a Calvados, we call it an apple brandy. And um, I love it. It's originally made by a Scottish colonist over in America in the late 1600s. So very old history to this particular drink, one of George Washington's absolute favorite. They originally called it Jersey Lightning which I'm sure will have its own Marvel movie soon. If Disney doesn't already own the rights to Jersey Lightning, sounds like a third string uh, Avenger, they'll, they'll soon have it. <laughs> right, Carrie's nodding her head because she is ready for me to move along. This is a simple cocktail today. There's no reason why this video needs to take five minutes. She is fed up, quite frankly, and also losing her mind. You see this down here? Please, Carrie, take, take the camera down there. These are, this is plastic grass that she is considering putting in our back garden. I'm against it. I'm kind of interested in getting a moss garden, actually. I hear it's really oh, good for the environment. Oh, come on. Okay, here's what's in this drink. The Applejack Rabbit. Uh, we've got the Laird's Applejack. We have a lemon juice. We also have a freshly squeezed orange juice. You don't have to use freshly squeezed, but make sure it's a nice one if you uh, aren't using freshly squeezed. And maple syrup, king of the sugar syrups. Maple, God bless it. So I'm gonna make myself a cocktail and my wife a cocktail because she's on her jolly holiday right now and she can join in with me. So for one of these, you're gonna pour in your shaker over ice two shots of the Laird's apple brandy. Keep in mind, I'm making uh, two of these uh, at the same time, so I'm putting four shots in there. Oh, goodbye, sweet apple brandy. Hate seeing the level of liquor go down on you. Okay, and then next ingredient I'm gonna throw in, it's 0.75 per drink of the lemon juice. So that is a shot and a half for our two drinks. One shot being 30 mils, half a shot being 15 mils. Same for the OJs, 0.75. So I'm doing two. That means I'm doing a shot and a half. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, look how full that's getting. Gee whiz. I packed that full of ice. Okay. And then finally, it's supposed to be a half a shot in the cocktail of the maple syrup. So I am doing a, uh, a full shot and then we're gonna shake vigorously you know that this is the time when I like to get my rage for the week out so I've got confessional kind of time today I've let all my herbs die I really haven't been paying attention to them over the last I don't know month and a half they did so well in the summer I had to put my basil and mint in the bin and look over at the sage Look at it. It's not doing well. That guy's going to die. <laughs> oh my God. I've got to start all over again. <sighs> You're shaking your head, Carrie, quite... It's disappointing. Quite, quite rightfully. I, I have very little to do around the house right now and that I couldn't attend to herbs. This is why we don't have kids. My cat runs this house, quite frankly. All right, so here we go. These are going into the coupe or martini glasses. There we go. One and two. How lovely. Okay. And 
and we're gonna use a lemon twist. I have pre-sliced them already. Why do I still have the knife out? I don't know why. I just like being a big show off, all right? I'm not boarding a plane anytime soon. And, okay, ooh, that's nice. I like hearing when the oil hits the top of the drink and it's, it's really lovely. So this is the Applejack Rabbit, one of many Laird's Applejack drinks that we're gonna make over the next couple months. I hope you enjoy this one. I certainly do. Cheers, everybody. Mm -hmm.